Is this acceptable? Please choose what skills to inherit. It seems no new power. Well then, shall we begin? This persona is powerful. Are you finished? We look... Welcome to the Velvet Room. This is your progress so far. Please take a look. Is this acceptable? Please take a look. This persona, yes? This persona, yes? This persona, yes? This person, is this acceptable? May it be your inner strength. This persona, so you'll be summoning this one. Very well, it's yours. Please take a look. This persona, yes? Is this acceptable? May it be your inner strength. Please take a look. This persona, yes? You can't carry any more than that. Are you finished? We look... Welcome to the Velvet Room. This is your progress so far. This persona, yes? This persona, yes? Please take a look. Is this acceptable? Very well, it's 
is yours. Are you finished? We look... Are my requests. Let's hear the results. Oh my! <laughs> you have my thanks. Very well. must be the method the culprit used to seemingly vanish into thin air. I see. 
The statute of limitations ran out three years ago. But with modern technology, we may be able to shed some light on this case. Perhaps. Have we received a new mission? I don't know, but the alarm's not ringing. designed to help control his persona. Basically, it's an evoker for dogs. Wait, does that mean Korumara was going to fight with us? I honestly wasn't expecting this either, but the test results show it's quite possible. In fact, it was actually a request from the chairman. We'll be looking after him here in the dorm. Koro-chan, is this what you want? He says... I'm returning the favor. Man, you're one loyal dog. Hey, sounds good to me. I, for one, welcome him with open arms. The more the merrier, right? Who cares if you're a dog? All right, I'll take him for a walk. And it's the perfect time, because it's summer break. Yes, it is. You're free to enjoy your vacation, but don't forget about your schoolwork. Summer classes start next week, so don't lose focus just because we have a lot of time off. Uh, summer... wait, what'd you say? Summer classes. Did you not hear about them? We're going to be taking supplemental courses. I've already applied for all of us. I know how difficult it's been to balance both school and our late-night excursions. I'm sure you haven't had much time to study, so I apologize for that. The chairman agreed it was a good idea as well. I could have sworn I told Takeba and Yamagishi. You serious? First I've heard of it! Oh, um, sorry. I completely forgot to mention it. No way! Hey, you're the one with the worst grades here. Why are you so surprised? Come on! I don't want to hear it. <laughs> don't you think? Uh, well, it's only for a few weeks, so let's do our best.
today's lesson is called the smaller the dog the louder the bark have you ever wondered what it would be like to see through people's bathing suits at the beach I've ever seen you this enthusiastic. Consumers might be persuaded by such candor. We could position you as the boy next door. Our company ran an ad in uh, adult magazines proposing a special filter for digital cameras. Simply attach it to your camera and voila! Start peeping! Untrust them with your camera's eye, it says. It's been selling like hotcakes. In fact, it's our number one seller. Unfortunately, customers have been complaining that it doesn't work. I told my staff to just ignore them. Nowhere does it guarantee that you'll be able to see anything. What are they gonna do? Tell everyone their creepy plan didn't work out? <laughs> Sorry, bucko. By the way, try to cut back on the donuts and cupcakes, huh? I have an idea for an ad campaign. Women would go crazy over a handsome young man in swim trunks. You'd be perfect for the job. Have you been keeping your promise? You didn't tell anyone, did you? If you go back on your word, I'll edit your face into the most obscene material I can find. It's amazing! I'm going... Good, good. Not bad, kid. Thanks, kid. Bubba.
Let's see. By the way. One magnificent melon, ain't she? It's the highlight of my day. So, I've been thinking of throwing a watermelon splitting party. We haven't really done anything summery since vacation started, you know? Especially Amada. He always looks so bored when I see him. And man, that kills me to see. It'd be a real shame if he didn't have a single entry in his summer picture diary. see the look on his face. He'll be like, Junpei san, you're super cool and you're super nice. Oh, I mean, don't you know? They say women can't resist a guy with a soft spot for kids. And you know what that means? I'm gonna need your help. It's a win-win situation, don't you think? And you know, oh boy. I think my arms are gonna fall off. shaping up to be a glorious day. Such a shame that the third years and the ladies won't be joining us. Um, if we're splitting watermelons, I'm out. What? Just like that? You're not even gonna hear me out? You have a watermelon and a bat. What else could it possibly be? That's more for little kids anyway. Plus, it's really hot out. And look, I get you're trying to be nice. Yeah, for real! Without you, it would just be me and him, you know? And isn't that just the saddest thing you ever heard? Well, when you put it that way, I guess I don't have a choice. I know, Koromaru. Don't you worry, boy. I didn't forget about you. All right, what are we waiting for? The youngest gets to draw first blood. Now this is what real summer feels like. My blood's pumping something fierce. Look who's acting like a kid now. <laughs> oh yeah, 
where's the blindfold? We can't split watermelons with just a bat. Speaking of, this bat seems kind of worn in, doesn't it? Oh, wow. You got that. That bat and I go way back. Had it since I was in Little League. I've never mentioned this before. Wow. Must have never had a chance to talk about it. That I used to play baseball. I mean, anyway, that's old news now. Wait, then should we really be hitting watermelons with this? Hmm? Ah, uh, well, nah, it's cool. Don't think I'll be using it much from here on out. What's wrong, bud? Dying a chomp on some melon? Koromaru? You can't swing at the watermelon with you in the way. Koromaru? Hey, why don't we use something other than the bat? See? Senpai thinks so, too. And what else are we gonna use? Um, uh, anything, I guess. Just as long as it's interesting. Interesting? Kind of a weird request. Oh! Like if Sonata-san uses bare hands? Someone say my name? Whoa! Sonata-san! Well, when I got back, I thought I heard voices coming from the roof. So I came to check it out. Hmm. Watermelon splitting, huh? That's right! We were just talking about what to use to hit it! You're not gonna use that bat? My fists on this? Oh my god, yes! I'd actually love to see that! That's okay, right, Jubei-san? Huh? Uh, sure. If that's what you want. Alright. Guess I'd better make this good then. Hey, try not to go all out or there won't be any left to eat. was still edible after it exploded like that. Didn't go exactly how I was expecting, but looked like a mod end. <sighs> Man, I was acting kind of lame back there, huh? You know, before we busted the melon. I'm talking about the whole bat thing. You were just trying to be thoughtful. I didn't want to come off like I was having second thoughts, but I guess I couldn't help it, huh? I was supposed to be this cool mentor, but instead, the kid ends up pitying me. <laughs> Don't worry about me anymore. I'll just get even sadder, you know? I mean, I'm not saying it's your fault. Uh, how the hell do I put it? This is a me problem. It probably doesn't make sense. I feel like my life, my teenage years, it's just all over the place. Anyway, I think we're done for today, yeah? Appreciate you helping me prep and clean up. Well, let's head back downstairs. came by to check in on Koromaru. Do you think he'll do well? That's good to hear. Well, given his reputation for loyalty, I wasn't too worried in the first place. If you have any concerns, please feel free to let me know anytime. It's only fair, considering I was the one who requested that Koromaru join the squad. Oh, I'm all for Koromaru joining us. He's totally welcome. 
I'll even throw in training lessons from the master. Um, I'm pretty sure Korachan's already more disciplined than you. Could you even sit still if someone told you to stay? Hey, don't compare me to a dog. I'm totally disciplined. I can follow directions. Kinda. Yeah, you really sold us on it. Anyway, so, Mr. Chairman, uh, about those summer classes. Ah, yes, I heard about Kirijo-kun's plan. It sounded like a good idea, so I went along with it. No, why would you agree to that? Oh, was I being nosy? Oh, I'm missing out on my passionate summer romance. She's disappearing before my eyes. Farewell, my beautiful city girl. Awaiting me by the shoreline. The city or the shores. Pick one. Even if you didn't have classes, you'd probably just bum around the station all day. You should just accept your fate. Oh, by the way, Mr. Chairman, weren't you about to tell us something before he arrived? Hmm? Ah, that's right. Aside from my unnecessary meddling, I do have another request for all of you. Does everyone have a moment? I think it's a good time for you all to get a routine health checkup. You know where Tatsumi Memorial Hospital is, right? Oh, that's where Sonata-senpai was treated before. With how much you've all been fighting lately, it'd be best to stay on top of your physical health. It wouldn't be good if your personas were causing any strain on your bodies, right? I expect it shouldn't be too much of a detour to stop by the hospital after your summer classes. I understand. Still, this is rather sudden. Don't worry too much about it. Like they say, a stitch in time saves nine. Or your side. We'll be doing the checkups individually, one day at a time. You can decide amongst yourselves who goes when. Don't forget to deck up for your checkup. <laughs> uh, just kidding. Oh, maybe bring your evokers in case you need to take any shots. <laughs> like a smart one unlike his owner <laughs> I'm just joking so how's life man and I love how the girl in that show has this mature vibe you know what I mean <laughs> what? whoa looks like this guy's had his fair share of fun guess we should start heading home then see it's cool
get on with today's lesson. So, continuing on. Let's do just that. That is to say... Well then... We'll get started. Okay, then. So, continuing on. Thanks for being so patient. That just about concludes your checkup. Sorry yours ended up taking so much longer than everyone else's. Oh, I'm glad to hear you say that. Although, we could have done it another time and taken a full day for it. Your persona abilities are rather unusual compared to the others, aren't they?
That's why we had to run so many more tests on you. Well, based on how you've performed so far, I don't expect there to be any problems. Persona abilities can be dangerous, depending on how they're used. With that in mind, it can't hurt to err on the side of caution. How are you feeling about it? Do you have any concerns about your power? That's understandable. But I don't think there will be any issues with your test results. And based on what I'm hearing from Kirijo-kun's reports, you've been performing just fine. I truly am grateful for everything the team has done, especially you. Things have really changed for the better since you arrived. Our team has grown, and we've even figured out how we can eliminate the dark hour. In a way, you've sort of gotten the clock ticking for us again. It's almost as if we were just waiting for you these past 10 years. <laughs> I'm afraid I can only support you from behind the scenes, but I'll be counting on you to eliminate the four remaining shadows. Now then, it's getting pretty late. Why don't we get you back to the door? Oops, excuse me for a second. Hello? Oh, thanks for your help the other day. Uh huh. Yes. It's missing from that document? It's urgent? Wait, but, but by today? Iwatodai, Iwatodai, this is the final train bound for Tatsumi Port Island. Please board before the scheduled departure time. You're at Iwatodai Station now. It's so late. You are starting to get worried. Um, did you run into any trouble? Oh, I see. I hope everything's all right. I'll let Kirijo Senpai know. We're in the command room right now. I'll go ahead and navigate you back to the dorm. I'm sure you'll be fine, but considering what happened with Korochan, I'd rather play it safe. <sighs> Wait, I can sense a shadow! And it's really close to you! It's over at the Moonlight Bridge! It's too dangerous to go alone. You should stay put until everyone else gets there. Oh no! There's another reading near the shadow! It's a person! Foolish enough to turn my back on such a predator. And on top of that, we have an unexpected guest tonight. Not a very favorable situation, all things considered. So, given this little predicament, how do you intend to partake? The enemy of my enemy is my friend, is it? Sound reasoning. What a hapless night, is it not? Well then, shall we begin? No! What to do? Sandy! Hmm, so that's your strategy. Tougher than it looks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here 
good target. As a reward for your efforts, let me show you my power. Come! Persona! How about this? The finale was surprisingly unsatisfying, wasn't it? Persona ability is truly fascinating. It's different from the one I saw the last time, isn't it? So, you can choose from multiple personas to fit the situation. You must be burdened with an extremely unusual fate. It seems your friend has arrived. Then I suppose I'll have to be on my way for tonight. What is your name? I'll see to it that I remember. Enemies though we may be, I'm not one for leaving a debt unsettled. I shall have to repay you another time. Are you all right? Did you already defeat the Shadow? Good work, but that was an unnecessary risk you took. You can fill me in on the way back. In any case, I'm glad you're okay. Yes. I'm sorry. Justin.